Russian soldier complains troops are treated like slaves. Two Russian soldiers serving in Ukraine spoke to a television network recently about being frustrated with their commanders and the poor conditions they've faced during the war. One of the troops said they feel like slaves due to not knowing when their service time will end. Current Time, a Russian language network that's run by Radio Free Europe stroke Radio Liberty in conjunction with Voice of America, posted the interviews to its website. The identities of the soldiers were concealed for their protection, according to Newsweek. One of the soldiers who spoke to Current Time was identified as Alexander, who was described as a military driver in Russia's armed forces. According to Alexander, his role is compromised by faulty equipment, which he worries could leave himself and others in the line of fire. He described the vehicles he operates as buckets of bolts that can hardly move. The commander isn't bothered that it will stall when the guys get in and then be targeted. Anything can happen. Alexander said, current time, named the other soldier interviewed as Ivan and said he's currently fighting on the front lines in Ukraine. Though he was happy to fight at first, like Alexander, he's ready to leave the battlefields behind. At this time, when he first went to Ukraine, I considered myself a patriot and wanted to fight for Russia, Ivan said. But having seen all the pluses and minuses of our army, I think the defense ministry has work to do. He added, I came basically voluntarily. I could have run away, but I didn't. Sometimes I regret this. Current time said the soldiers both complained of the harsh life they have experienced in the trenches where they have had to deal with cold, hunger and mice. Many of us feel like we're not soldiers but slaves because there are no time limits for us. We don't know how long we'll be here, Ivan said. The longer we're here, the less chance we'll come home.